the animation opens inside a forest showing Dasher, a papa bear, being chased by a hive of bees because he stole their honey. After running through the trees for some time, Dasher trips and falls, but still has the honey safe in his possession. He tries to hide inside a giant log of wood, so the angry bees won't find him, but his body is too big to pass through completely. The bees, now catching up with him, angrily sting him in their numbers, after which they leave him alone and retreat. Dasher stole the honey to prepare his son's favorite meal, which is a watermelon honey salad. Dasher loves his son so much that it has become his only weakness, and he would do everything he can to keep him happy. He gets back home after getting food and calls out to Ziha, his son, announcing his arrival with his favorite meal. Dasher is met with a performance by some young animals, and although he was scared at first, he became relieved after seeing his son. Ziha appears in the midst of the performance and dances for his father, after which he goes to meet him. Excited, Dasar holds him in a warm embrace, happy that he is okay and enthusiastic to show him the meal he got. Suddenly, Ziha slips away from his father's hold and flies across several trees, while the rest of the animals watch in shock. Dasher runs after his son, fearing for him and hoping to catch him, so he wouldn't land hard on the ground. Luckily, the little bear lands safely on a tree and stays there until his father gets to him. Dasher finally arrives where Ziha is and is relieved that nothing bad has happened to him. He scolds his son for playing dangerous games and pulling stunts when he knows how much he cares about him. Ziha on the other hand becomes sad, bringing to his dad's memory that it is his birthday and that the performance was to make him happy. Dasher then feels a bit remorseful and tries to explain things to Ziha but the little bear is already furious and doesn't want to listen. He requests for his mother whom he lost when he was a child and Dasher sadly reveals that she isn't coming back. Because of his childlike innocence, Ziha doesn't understand what his father meant and calls him a liar. After this exchange, father and son sit sadly in silence beside each other on a log of wood. At this moment, Dasher opens the watermelon honey salad which he prepared for his son and hands it to him. Ziha, who had already perceived the aroma, happily stretches out his hands to receive the meal when the unexpected happens. A bullet from nowhere hits the watermelon honey salad, scattering the content and pieces around. This jolts Dasher and Ziha who now realize that there is danger lurking because poachers have arrived at the forest. Picking Ziha and putting him on his back, Dasher dashes across the forest, dodging bullets as he tries to run to safety. Unfortunately, he misses a step while running, making him trip and fall into a pit, but Ziha doesn't fall like his father. He calls out to his father from the mouth of the pit, and Dasher responds, telling him to run to safety. Ziha refuses to leave his father, as he does not want to lose him. Some moments later, the poachers catch up with Ziha and take him away as he screams for help. Dasher does his best to climb out of the hole to save his son, but his efforts prove futile. Ziha is placed in a cage and out inside a vehicle, which begins conveying him away from the forest, to strong grip. Picking himself up, he goes after the truck, which is already far ahead, and by the time he catches up, sees that Ziha has been transferred to a train. Dasher does his best to catch up with the train by hopping on it, but he misses it and watches downtrodden as it moves far from him. Luckily for him, another train arrives immediately after, and he gets on with his son's safety in mind. Dasher spends the night in the cold, and he is plagued with nightmares about his wife's death. In the morning, Dasher wakes up in a place that is strange to him and he also sees a dog flying around the area. He is at the warehouse where the cargo is being offloaded, so he sneaks off to find his son by using his scent. He soon discovers that Ziha has been placed in a white van, which he goes after to retrieve him. He arrives at a carnival that he tries to go through to get to his son, and he blends in well with the bear's costume. As he moves away to continue chasing after his son, his attention is brought to a child in danger. Dasher is caught in a dilemma to either help the little boy or go after his son, and he chose to help the boy. The little boy who was stuck on a machine loses his grip and falls as the police are climbing to rescue him. Everyone around watches in shock as the boy falls, but Dasher comes in to save him as he provides a safe landing spot for the child with his stomach. The people gather around Dasher, thanking him for his heroic actions, and in the midst of this, the flying dog he saw earlier asks to see him. This dog is an animal agent named Wonto, and he has information that would help Dasher find his son. According to the agent, Ziha has been taken to a logistics company that runs an underground smuggling business. He tells Dasher that other animals have been held hostage by the company, and they would be smuggled if they are not helped. 
The agent also asked that the big bear work with him, so they would combine both of their skills to find their targets. However, Dasher isn't interested in forming any alliance with Agent Wanto, so he heads out to search for the company. He is unable to leave the woods because the agent has put certain restrictions and after trying for a while, gives up and accepts Wanto's offer. They both begin training for their task ahead, with Agent Wanto supervising all of it. At the company, Ziha is taken in and painted to look like a panda by one of the workers, who try to avoid the boss's wrath about the absence of one in their collection. After he has been painted, he is taken to an underground warehouse where many other animals are confined to their various cages. Ziha is placed inside his cage and when the news reaches the boss that they have finally gotten a panda, he orders that the animals be shipped out before midnight. Meanwhile, Dasher and Agent Wanto suit up outside in their agent uniforms in preparation for the rescue mission ahead of them. Inside the warehouse, Ziha realizes that his cage wasn't properly locked by one of the workers, so he comes out. He walks around the room and gets acquainted with the rest of the animals as they devise a plan to escape. Dasher and Wanto infiltrate the company's security, turning off the alarms and knocking out the guards as they advance. Dasher changes outfits to properly disguise as one of the company's workers, and they go to find the animals. Along the way, Dasher expresses his gratitude to Wanto for putting his life on the line for his son, but the agent responds indifferently. At the warehouse, Ziha and the animals are done with the escape plan, and now they wait for the execution. When two of the workers come in to properly lock Ziha's cage, he steals one of their key cards from them. After they have left, he unlocks his cage and that of the other animals and they are excited. Dasher, on the other hand, fights off the guards who attack him and Wanto while they try to find a way through the security doors. They fight them off and take the door card, which they use to open all the doors inside the building. As soon as all the doors open, Ziha and the rest of the animals leave the warehouse, running across the building to their safety. Wanto takes Dasher to a room where they see an unconscious man who is bound with ropes. This man is Wanto's master, an agent, and whom he came to rescue. He was captured during their first infiltration into the warehouse, but Wanto escaped. At this point, Dasher feels used and betrayed, so he runs out to find his son. Coming out of the room, he is almost crushed to death by the animals because he is still in the guard's uniform. The boss soon finds out about the animals' escape and sends out more of his men, ordering that the doors be shut back up. As the doors are getting shut, Dasher sees his son amid the chaos, but is unable to get him because the doors get shut. He transfers his anger to Wanto and tells him that he never should have trusted him. This makes Wanto sad, and he heads out to find a way out of the warehouse. He fights off the guards with his gadgets and finally escapes into the woods. The animals are now stranded in one place as the doors are locked, so the boss orders that they be drugged. They are all drugged through the air vents in the room, and they fall unconscious, one after the other. Dasher, on the other hand, does his best to fight the guards who come after him, but he is also hit with tranquilizers and a taser. The animals are then loaded into a train where they would all be shipped to the buyer. Dasher is placed in a different cage and while he is taken to his compartment, he recognizes his son and immediately starts rebelling. He frees himself from the cage and runs to the compartment where Ziha is, trying to rescue his son. The boss orders his men to kill him this time around because he has caused so many problems. The train begins moving and Dasher goes after it with the men running behind him with weapons. However, he gets on the train and carefully walks to where his son is. Ziha on the other hand has given up hope about his father coming to save him and the animals. It is at this moment that Dasher breaks into their compartment and breaks them free from their cages. Ziha is excited to be finally reunited with his father and the other animals thank him for helping them. He releases some other animals from their cages and they all plan on how to fight off the guards and escape. Tiger and Rhinoceros join Dasher on the roof of the train to fight the guards, while the other animals stay safe inside the train. A fierce fight breaks out between Dasher's team and the boss's men. The guards begin shooting nets to capture the animals, but the animals tactically dodge the nets. The Rhinoceros is captured but later released by his teammates, and they square up to resume fighting. Most of the boss's men are beaten and knocked unconscious by Dasher, the Tiger, and the Rhinoceros. During the fight, the men begin shooting tranquilizers at the animals, but Dasher uses a wooden board to protect himself. He loses possession of Ziha as he accidentally gets hit with one of the drugs and one of the men picks him up. In a bid to save his son, he injects the man with the remaining content of the drug, and he falls unconscious. 
Ziha is back with his father and is concerned about the impact of the drug, but Dasher waves it off, telling him that it is nothing. Inside the train, they come face to face with the boss, who doesn't understand why a bear would care so much for a panda. He attacks both Ziha and Dasher, and they both run to the roof of the train, where they are also stopped by the boss's men. The other members of the team have been subdued, and now, Dasher and Ziha are surrounded by the boss and his men. The boss cocks his gun to shoot at Dasher, and is immediately hit by an unknown bullet. To everyone's surprise, a helicopter appears above them, and suited men alight from it onto the moving train. Dasher is scared at first but gets relieved when he sees Wonto coming in his direction. Ziha is introduced to the agent, who notifies them that he got help from the other agents. The boss, on the arrival of the agents, hides in the control room and steals one of the agent's jetpacks after injecting him with poison. A loud noise coming from the train alerts the animals and the other passengers that it has lost control. The boss escapes from the train with devilish laughter, announcing that he had damaged the control center of the train. Wonto gives Dasher directions on how to save the compartment which the animals are in, after which he flies off to fight the boss. The animals, on the other hand, lock the boss's men inside the cages and wait for Dasher to do his thing. While Wonto fights with the boss on air, Dasher and Ziha try to disconnect the damaged part of the train from the rest. They finally find the key to disconnecting it, and after some effort, they successfully do it. However, Dasher is stuck on the damaged side of the train which, at this point, is moving at a high speed. He says his final goodbyes to Ziha, promising to always be with him, and some moments later, the train crashes. The compartment carrying Ziha and the rest of the animals grinds to a violent halt, and everywhere becomes peaceful. Wonto, after defeating the boss, runs to the accident area to look for Dasher. Ziha on the other hand is heartbroken about his father's accident, but Dasher's sudden appearance brightens his mood. Seeing that they are now safe, the animals become excited and begin rejoicing. Wonto is awarded for his exceptional performance in helping the animals and rescuing his fellow agent. As a result of the efforts of the animals in fighting the bad guys, the animal agent department was established.